all right welcome back uh like i said last time hopefully this hopefully this one gives me the age because it's low-key important and it's annoying it's annoying as hell when it doesn't give it to me There we go. 60, The Templars have retaken their archive on Cyprus. Abbas sent no reinforcements. It was a massacre. Oh my God. Maria, when we left myself 10 years ago, this order was strong. But all that progress has been undone. Abbas must answer for this. Answer to whom? The assassins obey only his command now. Resist your desire for revenge, Altair. Speak truth, and they will see their error. He executed our youngest son, Maria. He deserves to die. Perhaps. But if you cannot win back the Order by honorable means, its foundation will crumble. You are right. Thirty years ago, I let passion overtake my reason. And it caused a rift that has never fully healed. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait because uh, they're gonna talk. But this is the cutscene. Speak reasonably, uh. and reasonable men will listen. Some will, but not Abbas. I should have expelled him 30 years ago when he tried to steal the apple. But you earn the respect of the other assassins because you let him stay. How do you know this? You were not there. I married a masterful storyteller. Look at this place. Masyaf is a shadow of its former self. We have been away for a long time. But not in hiding. The Mongol threat demanded our attention and we rode to meet it. What man here can say the same? Where is our eldest son? Does Darim know his brother is dead? I sent him a message four days ago. If luck, it has reached him already. Abbas, I almost pity him. He wears his grudge like a cloak. His wound is deep. It will help him to hear the truth. As I walk these streets, I sense a great fear in the people. Not love. Abbas has dismantled this place and robbed it of all joy. We may be walking to our doom, Maria. We may, but we walk together. All right. I, I, I can't. The thing that I want to say, I can't say now. So I'll wait. Abbas. Let them speak. We seek the truth about our son's death. Why was Seth killed? Is it the truth you want? Or an excuse for revenge? If the truth gives us an excuse, we will act on it. Surrender the apple, Altair, and I will tell you why your son was put to death. Ah, the truth is out already. Abbas wants the apple for himself, not to open your minds, but to control them. You have held that artifact for 30 years, Altair, reveling in its power and hoarding its secrets. It has corrupted you. Very well, Abbas. Take it. What? Before I executed your son, I told him you ordered it yourself. He died. Believing you had betrayed him. El Tayer! El Tayer! No! Strength, El Tayer. Maria. He is possessed! Kill him! Take the apple! No! See? See what I'm talking about? This is the, uh... Oh, shit. This is the, uh, the memory that I think of whenever I, I say that, uh... Whenever I think about the, the issues that this game has. Because, uh... 
first of all, the music uh, at the beginning of the cutscene was so loud. Oh, oh shit. Was so loud. Even when I turned it down, it was still loud. Uh, you're you're too old to be doing that. But anyways, um, and then the uh, the stabbing, the stabbing sound effect was so early. It's 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 all over the place. And then the the audio kept cutting out, kept cutting out. It was weird. Father, I got your message. What has happened? That him, turn back. Have they all gone mad? We have to go. Abbas must not get his hands on the apple. If you need more knives, take them. Above you. Where is mother? She's... She's gone, Darim. Yeah. I'm sorry. Ahead of us! What? How? Later. First, we fight. Oh no, I have 99. I have 99. I've got to get out of here. Brothers! We need not fight! Forget reason, Darim. They've been poisoned by lies. Oops. Come on, come on. We must leave at once! Hurry! I'm following you, I'm following Watch you. out! Since we weren't doing anything. No! We cannot let them catch us! Was it Abbas who killed my brother? Yep. He killed your brother, Malik, and countless others. He is a madman. Oh, a shit. madman with an army. He will die. One day he will pay. Oh, what the? Sorry. <laughs> What the hell? Stay alert! Was it Abbas who killed my brother? All right, all right. I will have the apple, Altair. And I will have your head for all the dishonor he brought upon my family. You cannot run forever. Not from us and not from your lies. What are you?
Oh, that's it. I was about to say, oh, why am I, why am I outside? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's done. Excellent news, Claudia. I now have a name. Manuel Paleologos. Nephew of the deposed Byzantine Emperor Constantine. I have few doubts that he is the man leading the Templars. My task now is to interrogate a traitorous janissary named Tarek Barletti and find the location of the Templars' army. Until then, Sophia and I will continue our search for the one key that remains hidden. With every passing moment, I know my chances grow slimmer. And yet I cannot help but linger some days to stay an extra hour with her. To hear her voice and watch her face animate with joy as she speaks of the things that move her. Her books, her city, her memories. I cannot help but think what a shame it will be when I find the final key. Oh, let's see. That's not a legal move. It is a European variation. Arocco. It's interesting, but not exactly fair when you play by different rules than your opponent. You may think differently when you are Sultan. Shall I take it back? Suleiman, I know it has been hard on you watching your father and me quarrel over Bayezid's throne. Grandfather has chosen you, and his word is canon. What is there to argue about? Your father and I were close once, but his cruelty and ambition have made... I have heard the rumors, uncle. Well, I have a meeting with the vizier soon. Shall we continue another time? Whenever you like. Ezio. Tarek has been selling guns to a local miser, Manuel Paleologos. Paleologos? That is a sad sound. The last Byzantine emperor was Constantine Paleologos. If his heir is arming a militia of some kind, this conflict will escalate. Tarek knows where the rifles are headed. If I find him first, I can follow the weapons straight to the Byzantines. He will be with his Janissaries in their barracks. So if you want to get close, you will have to be one yourself. Not a problem. Guzel. Get the information you need. Then kill him. Are you sure? You told me Tarek and your father were close friends, Suleiman. This is true, but such naked treason against my grandfather deserves death. In Daisy. Nope. That's a mistake. All right. I'll try. <coughs> what the? One of the benefits of uh, I think I've said it before, but one of the benefits of replaying a game that you already played is you can play it when you're tired because I am tired as hell my patience is wearing <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? Oh.
What the hell? What the hell is he doing? Move. Start moving. He's out. He's not gonna move. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna get him to move. Jesus Christ. Give it. Yeah, yeah. That was awful. I needed to use the bomb. I didn't think about it until I I uh, called the assassins. Selim understands our plight. The Byzantines, the Mamluks, the Safavid. Only he has the courage to face these threats. Mark, listen. Selim is a warrior, like Osman and Mehmed. So why has our Sultan chosen a calf over our lion? Dark tidings, citizens of Constantinia. Ahmed really? shares the Sultan's calm temperament. The they are criminal, too much alike. been stripped of his garments. Be on the lookout for any suspicious activity. Citizens, Here we are. beware. Jesus. A killer stalks our streets without conscience, targeting the servants of our Sultan. The Janissaries have dedicated their lives to the protection of the Empire. Return the favor and find this killer before he strikes again. What the hell was that? Oh. Yes, Let me get out of your way. Jesus. Jesus, that's you. Praise be on you, good warden. Get out of here! Please be on you, good warden! Oh my god. In the city. He knows he's not wanted. He is like a moth hovering around an open flame, waiting for his father to perish so that he may step to the throne. Did you hear he offered Tarek a sum of money in exchange for her loyalty? God damn it! What did... Kardesh Larim! One of our own was found murdered and stripped of his garments not an hour ago. His body dumped like a mound of rubbish. Keep a close watch on these streets as you move about. Someone is planning to strike in our name. We must be ready. Mm. Have you met Selim's young son? Shehzade Suleiman? Not personally, but I have seen him. 
I know he is a remarkable boy. Not a boy, but a capable young man with a magnificent mind. Does he take after his father? Belke. Though I suspect he is another sort of man altogether. I know what to do. Holy oh, shit. to be there A message for you. Ariculare. <laughs> the rifles have arrived in Cappadoce, where Manuel has garrisoned his army. And our men? Are they still with him? Evet. They will contact us when the Byzantines decamp. Then we will meet them when they reach Pursa. Everything is falling into place, Effendum. Evet. For once. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Your mother has a... We had a suspected plot of die under questioning today. Hard girl. Just like that thing in the You know what? Remember him? From that ship. I've like never that. done it from from this angle. So let's do it from this angle. I always, I always, oh. I always go the other way, so. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I've got you. Oh, God damn it. What the hell was that? That was, that was a, that was a slight bump. That was BS. That was just a... A little bump. Ah. How is your brother doing? of Suleiman's investigation. You collude with the Sultan's enemies. What did you expect would come of such treachery? I blame myself. Not for treason, but hubris. I was preparing an ambush. Preparing to strike the Byzantine Templars where they felt safest. What proof do you have of this? Uh, see, here. This 
who will lead you to the Byzantines in Cappadocia. Destroy them if you can. You have done well, Tarek. Forgive me. Protect my homeland, assassin. Allah Ashkila. Redeem the honor we have lost in this fight. My bad. Sorry. I am getting tired of this uniform. Yeah, but first we have to get the hell out of here. Nope. You will not get through. Ooh. Jump. Sore bottom time. I think I'm just standing here. Complain to the boss if you don't like the friendly. <laughs> and X. I have smoke bombs. Shit. Jesus. All right, all right, all right, all right. Stop. everywhere oh my <laughs> oh shut the Jesus. Hmm. 
Oh shit. No, what? Stop him! Fuck me. No, my guy just run, just run. There we go. So, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Oh. Mm. I need to buy medicine and armor. Upgrade it. Isn't that dangerous? No, oh, shut up. Wait, wait. Oh shit. Yep, 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 yep. Oh shit. Ah oh, shit. Where is he at? I know that man. Don't let him escape. Ah. I hate this one. I hate this one. Oh. I forgot about I forgot about that. I didn't see them, so. Oh, sh oh, never mind. Away from them, away from them. Tarek was no traitor, Suleiman. He too was tracking the bits and teens. What? So did you... I'm sorry. God forgive me. You should not have been so quick to judge. He was loyal to your grandfather to the end. And through his efforts, we have the means to save your city. Tarek... You should not have been so secretive. What a terrible way to do a good thing. 
The weapons were taken to Cappadoce. Can you get me there? Yes, of course. I will arrange a ship to take you. Suleiman! Suleiman! I have been oh, set please. up and made to look a traitor. He saw you, Remember Ezio. Tariq, the Janissary. The man you quarreled with? He has been murdered. It is no secret that he and I were at odds. Now the Janissaries will accuse me of this crime. This is terrible news, Uncle. When war gets back to my father, he will banish me from the city. Ah, forgive me, nephew. I was not aware that you had a guest. This is Marcello, one of my European advisors in Cafe. Buonasera. Marcello, my nephew and I have a private matter to discuss. As I said, there will be a ship waiting for you when you wish to leave. Grazie, mio principe. We will track <laughs> down the perpetrator of this crime, uncle. Have patience. Oh shit. How can we help? Hold tight. Nope. Stay there. Hmm. All right. Why would this silly? Not my problem. Alright, uh, second to last key. I need to buy some armor. I need to buy some armor. Get up! And medicine. Oops. Enjoying the poem? Who are these men he condemned to hell? Political opponents. Men who wronged him. Alighieri's quill cuts deeply, no? See, si. It is a subtle way to seek revenge. Ezio. I plan to make a trip to Andrianopoli in a few weeks to visit a new printing press there. That should be fun. It is a five or six day ride from here, and I will need an escort. Prego. Oh, I'm sorry, you are a busy man. Sophia, I would love to accompany you, but my time is running short. That is true for all of us. Well, I can try to solve this last code now, but I need to run an errand before sundown. Can you wait a day? What do you need? It is silly, but a bouquet of fresh flowers. White tulips, specifically. I can get you the flowers. Nessun problema. Are you sure? It would be a nice change of pace. Bene. Meet me in the park east of Aya Sofia, and we will trade. Flowers for information. Damn it, I keep forgetting. Every single time I move the uh, the cable, it cuts out the uh, the audio. So if it cuts out, and it's been cutting out since Brotherhood, I don't know if it's been cutting out since AC2. If it did in AC2, then my bad. But I noticed it in Brotherhood, so and I, and I just did it. I'll try not to move it. So my bad. It's just so random. I move it a little bit and it cuts out. Like I'm moving it right now, and it's not cutting out. So it cut out for like five for like a second. I didn't miss anything, it wasn't dialogue. Okay. I don't know if I have to buy a new chat link, but in, I noticed that in Brotherhood when I was editing, I was like, oh shit. But thankfully, well, it was during the, the cutscenes, so all I had to do was like, uh, replay the, the memories and get the cut and replay that, wait, I'll wait. You look like a man with money to spend. What do you need, Dostum? Tulips. White, if you have them. 
Ah, tulips. Uh, forgive me, but I am fresh out. Something else, perhaps? It is not my call, unfortunately. All right. Listen, I may know where to get fresh tulips. You wait here, and I will return. One hour. Two at most. I am not waiting an hour. <laughs> but yeah, I, when I noticed it, I was so mad. But because I thought it was only me. I thought it was just cutting out on my end. Um, but to get the audio for the cutscenes, all I had to do was uh, replay the memories and just get the audio again. But if it happened during the gameplay, then whatever. It's whatever. And if it happened in AC2 during a cutscene, and I don't remember if it did, uh, too bad because even if I noticed it, I wasn't going to be able to replay it. So, but yeah, it's, it bothered me. So I'll try not to move it. These prices are dead. Oh. I never do it, so I, I thought, eh, I'll do it now. I'll do it now. The awe of the grandfather has, in conjunction with the guild of Tadius, authorized to be determined by quality of information. Sublime Sultan Basis has been told. My wife's voice is most shrill. Penetrating. <laughs> it's funny, but I have been so busy this last while, I have barely seen her. Oh, Lord. Don't mind me. Anyone carry on like that? What the hell is it? Oh. That's it. What is this? A gift. Sit. Che belli, grazie. I wanted to thank you for letting me play a small role in your adventure. A small role is enough for this adventure, believe me. You are a mystery, Ezio Auditore. Mi dispiace. I do not mean to be. It is fine. È affascinante. Sembra squisito. Why, thank you. Any luck with the final code? Ah, the code, si. I solved it many hours ago. You will get it soon enough. Now that I remember, I was worried that it was uh, cutting out the audio from the game because I remember in AC2 where it was it cut out on my headphones, and then when I was editing, I was looking for that specific um, part when it when it happened, and it, and I didn't see anything, so I was like, oh, maybe it's just me. So that's why I've been ignoring it. Oh, I didn't ignore it. I just wasn't paying attention to it because of that because of that moment oops Does this amuse you? not really i i haven't seen a doctor in forever and i need to buy stuff
Oh shit. 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 Ah. Less than 10 minutes. I don't know, without, without falling into the water. Alright, I don't have to hurry up. I do have to hurry up, but I think. Yes. Yes, I do. Oh, shit. Nope. Oh, my God. the water, the water leaves through there, and now the water is a little uh, lower. Which is a nice change of pace, nice change of pace instead of always uh, trying to go up we actually we actually have to go down
by this way. Yeah, I'll talk about it now. Um, I was gonna wait, but the only other the only other time I I heard the uh, the song and the trailer for for this was um, the spiteful chant by Kendrick Lamar. So when I first heard that song, I was like, holy shit, this is the song that was in the, uh, that was in the, uh, Revelations trailer. But I heard that song, like, years later, for the first time. So. Yeah, that's it. But yeah, that was, but I heard that song like years afterwards and I was like, holy shit. So if I was a fan of, I was a fan of Kendrick, but if I, if I would have listened to Section 80, like when it came out, I would have heard that song first on that instead of the the trailer which is a you know fun fun little that's a that's a thing that's a that's a thing that I think about a little bit sometimes I just wanted to say that I don't know before I forgot it's a fun little tidbit But yeah, that, that was fun. 